Hi there, my name is Mr. Richard Kim and I'm the teacher of the Cisco IT Essentials class. Uh, this class is an exciting opportunity for students who want to uh, venture into a career in IT. Uh, this uh, class through Cisco uh, allows them to learn about computing, uh, the ins and outs of a computer, and it's the introductory class uh, that's a great gateway to getting a career or at least getting a job right out of high school um, in the career of technology and IT. Uh, in this class, we will be using um, the website called NetACAD, which is the Cisco website that has a lot of resources of tests um, that will get them ready and prepare them for uh, what we call is the CompTIA A plus uh, certification. So through this class, we're going to go through labs and we're going to have uh, go through the online textbook. Uh, we'll take various quizzes, as you can see right here. Uh, as we go through some of the different um, topics of each section, we talk about all of the the main things of a computer, uh, as you can see right here in chapter one. Through it all, uh, the hope is that at the end of the year, they're going to be ready to be able to take the test and they could actually get uh, take the certification test once again to get the uh, CompTIA A plus uh, certification. Uh, the great thing right here is that students are able to, uh, by taking the class at Walnut High School, they can get a, a discount voucher uh, to take the class and get certified. And also taking this class right here, um, they're, they're able to take it for free, uh, which is typically a $700 plus uh, class for students that, are, that would normally take it. So this is a great opportunity uh, for them to get their uh, feet wet and to be able to get ready for the, a wonderful career in internet technology. Uh, through the class, once again, uh, this is the website that they're going to look at or that they have access to and they've got if we launch the course you can see all the different chapters and what we'll be covering throughout the entire school year okay so now we're not covering uh, a lot of it is kind of the uh, basics of each of these sections okay it's not going to look we're not going to get into detail about networking because that would be step two uh, for our CCNA course that they could take next year. So we're going to kind of at least highlight all the main parts of, as it says, IT essentials. And once again, they can click through. There's plenty of videos uh, for them to watch. There's quizzes for them to take. Uh, to get them ready for some of the assessments that we that I'll be giving them, but also to prepare them for the CompTIA A plus certification. I give them plenty of assignments to supplement and videos to also watch to supplement what we've been going over. As you can see right here, there are several different videos that I have uh, had them. Uh, had them watch and what I asked for them is to give me a, at least a paragraph summary of each of these um, topics. I'll grade them with the rubric and they get and I give them feedback immediately. For, for the class grade uh, what I tell the students here is this. Most of this class typically is going to be uh, based on their test grade. Uh, because we're doing distance learning and not taking the tests and quizzes at, at, uh, in class, uh, the percentage of their test grades is going to be 60%. That is the weight of the class. And the other 40% will be uh, the class work and everything else that, we've, that we're working on here. Uh, so, for example, all these homework assignments, uh, those will be part of the 40%. The labs that we'll be doing together, hopefully if we are able to come back to school, will be part of the 40%. And, but the 60% of the grade is going to be based on the quizzes and tests that we have. 
I do allow students to retake a test. Uh, however, the max that they can get for a retest is, is going to be 90 or 10% less of what it was. So the first time they take a test, they can get 100%. However, the second time they take a test, if they happen to retake it, the max score that they can achieve is 90%. If they happen to retake the test again, the maximum they could achieve is 80%. So they do have opportunities of retesting. Uh, I recommend that they do because they'll be able to see the questions more and more and get familiar and hopefully help them memorize uh, these concepts and terms uh, that we are covering throughout the school year. I have them make uh, take notes in using a Google document to kind of um, show so I could read later. Are they taking notes? Are they uh, writing down uh, vocabulary terms? Are they understanding the videos that they're watching? And so that is also another criteria of their grade. Okay. If you have any questions on this class, what they could, uh, what's expected of them, uh, you could always email me right here at rjkim at wvusd.org. And uh, I'll get back to you as soon as I can, hopefully at least within 24 hours if it's during the, uh, the weekday. And on the weekend, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Um, please, if you haven't read the, uh, the class expectations, uh, which you apparently have because I had the students, uh, you know, that was one of their requirements uh, for their homework assignment. And uh, so, yeah, please read it over if you haven't done so, so that you can kind of understand uh, what's expected of them uh, as far as when they're in the class and through distance learning and when, what they're expected of them when they're back on campus, hopefully by the end uh, sometime this year. All right, so once again, uh, a great exciting class for them where they could actually uh, get their certification uh, which will allow them to get you know many entry level jobs uh, to get their feet wet and get some experience uh, in the the ever growing world of internet technology. Bye bye.